in XFC, there's no built-in way to control your volume with your keyboard. You always have to go to the volume icon down here and control it this direction or with the scroll wheel on your mouse. There's an easy way to fix this. The first thing you do is go to your menu. Now in this case I have the whisker menu. If you have one of the other ones it should work almost the same way. Now you can either hit the all settings icon up here at the top or you can search for settings and then hit settings editor. Oops, wrong one. I always do that with XFC. Settings. Settings. Manager. That's better. The next thing you want to do is under hardware here, click keyboard. And then application shortcuts. Now, you may have to end up resizing this window because I think originally it looks something like this. So you may not see these add and edit and remove buttons uh, by default. If so, just resize it and you'll be able to very easily get those uh, to show up. So you just hit add. Now this first command will be to increase the volume. And you just simply type in a mixer set master okay and then here you choose a percentage you want the volume to increase by each time you hit the key binding that you'll choose in the next step the one you'll find most often is five percent I like to set it for three it just gives you a finer grain a finer control of the setting so and then you hit the percentage key so three percent and then the plus now this just that just means that it's going to add three percent each time you hit the, the binding and then you click okay now here it's going to ask you to create the command shortcut i always choose command d and then it will disappear now you'll know it worked is if at the top here it says it shows up okay now you want to do the shortcut for subtracting volume it's simply the same a mixer set master and then I you can choose a different percentage but you probably should keep it the same that's just percent and then here's where it's different instead of plus it's just a minus and then you have to select the command shortcut I'm going to use F control F and as you can see here it showed up now if you look up here in the upper right hand corner if I now press those key shortcuts the volume will con be controlled by the keyboard I no longer have to use my mouse to control the volume now you can also use the if you have a keyboard that has volume controls built in and this do, and they're not automatically working for you you can use the same thing here just instead of using a shortcut key combination like I did just hit that key on your keyboard and it should work so that is it you can just hit controls and you're all finished uh, thank you for watching if you'd like to see more tutorials hit the like button and maybe subscribe that'd be awesome thank you for watching